Maybe we're not in the Middle East at all. Maybe we're in Juarez, Mexico. Hello friends, my name is Brandon Dayton. I am your humble narrator. And this is Insurgency. It is a game all about tactics. You, you're the regulator. We're gonna follow potatoes. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna crawl back to the the back end of this corridor right here. All right, let's do it. Execute the plan. <laughs> it is a game all about proper use of smoke grenades and suppression fire. Okay, this is not going well. More grenades! More grenades! Oh my god, I'm gonna get dropped even behind this truck. They are going hard. I'm gonna get up here. Take the hill! I'm trying to get up here for suppression fire. Kill the smoke! Kill the smoke! Kill the smoke! Kill the smoke! But most importantly, it is a game that I am giving away to three, yes count them three, commenters below. Completely random, you don't have to be first, you can be the last, doesn't matter to me. Uh, please comment before Tuesday and I will do the drawing on Wednesday. And you can get it for a dollar, four copies of Insurgency for a dollar on Humble Bundle for a few more days. So that is also linked in the description. And I hope you go pick that up and help out some charities and get some awesome games in the process. So let's take a look at the classes. You have uh, supply points in the lower right hand corner and the costs are designated. This is the recon class. It has a lot of submachine guns and uh, delicious goodness. You get uh, laser sights and flashlights and all the classes have different things that they can equip. Most of them can equip suppressors and uh, they all have the same secondary pistol, Markarov and M9. Those can get suppressors and laser sights as well and uh, also hollow point and armor piercing ammo which is pretty sweet. And let's see. I think armor is a good thing to cover. It's free. Light armor is free for the US forces. Heavy armor is two supply points. For insurgents, it's uh, two points for light armor and four for heavy armor, which kind of makes the PvP different, but it's not terrible. As for the grenades, you get uh, all sorts. You can carry different grenades with your chest carrier, uh, but if you have a chest rig, you can only carry one grenade as opposed to two which is unfortunate. The specialist class also has tons of submachine guns and I generally like to do a two times dot. A the rifleman has mostly auto, semi-auto rifles and access to flash grenades which is special. The breacher has a lot of shotguns and I freaking love the shotguns especially with slugs because it makes it possible for long-range engagements oh fuck oh they're both they're, they're everywhere <laughs> uh, base yeah breacher is the best Demolitions has access to different underbarrels, uh, smoke and frag grenades as their underbarrel, which is freaking awesome. Do not take the bipod or foregrip if you're demolitions. They also get access to C4 and uh, the RPG, which can only be displayed like this. Keep your eyes peeled, guys. Woo! <laughs> the designated marksman has access to MK4 scope, which is almost nine times zoom. Which, which is pretty awesome. Makes him uh, a force. The support is one of my favorites. Lots of light machine guns, always. And the sniper has access to the MK4 scope as well, as well as lots of pretty sweet bolt action rifles. So he's a force to be messed with, though I like him with heavy armor instead of light. 
Without any further ado, we should probably check out some gameplay. I really like that this game has no UI. No ammo counter at all. So you kind of just have to tactically reload and hope that you're doing the right thing. I've got a pretty nice zoom. I'm playing as the specialist. I think this is the three times zoom scope. It's not as wide open as the sniper's nine times zoom though. This first hill in Sinjar is so hard. Oh my god. Yep. Gratuitous use of bullets there. They're everywhere. I hear them absolutely everywhere. They're swarming. Somebody's screaming about an RPG. Uh, the most terrifying thing about this game is you can get hit, killed in just one hit. If if somebody lands a headshot, you're you're basically done. Ugh. I don't know how many of my people are left up. I will never surrender! Oh, I don't think I got that guy. <laughs> but I was trying real hard. Ooh. Boop, 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 boop. Did he die? I don't know. The only time you're ever told if you killed something is when you get the first blood achievement. Uh oh. And now I'm the last man standing. Which is awesome. Maybe I can save everybody. Maybe I can be the hero. I want to be the hero! By the way, why do they all sound like Mexicans? Reloading! Get him! Maybe we're not in the Middle East at all. Maybe we're in Juarez, Mexico. Might as well go try and take Alpha. Not gonna... Uh, get anybody respawn sitting around down there. Damn it. Oh, fart. Of course it's not one guy. It's never one guy, is it? Eat grenade. And then I'll go get your friends. Holy shit. Holy shit. Holy shit. Okay. It's bad. <laughs> I have a knife. And a wimpy throw on the grenade. I'm so done. It's Alva. Hey, we're taking Alpha. Alpha is under attack. Alpha is under attack. By me. Oh. This game is so hopeless. I can't do it. I just want to go home. I want to see my family. Oh, it's too real. Too fucking real. Oh look, MVP. So friends, this is what I got. I hope this game has caught your attention. It is beautifully done in the Source Engine. And I have three copies to give away once again. It is as simple as leaving a comment down below. I would appreciate a like or even a subscription if you did enjoy what I've presented here today. And if not, then please let me know what I can do differently to win your subscription. Because it does matter to me. So, this has been Insurgency. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator, with another Dayton Dissects. I hope you guys will join me for the next time. Until then, friends, bye bye One, two, three, four, goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.